everybody, it's your boy Titanic FJ, and I'm back at you again with another video. I'd like to welcome everyone back to the channel. What is going on with everybody? How y'all doing? Anybody new watching for the very first time, I'd like to welcome you to the channel as well. Please drop a comment in the comment section. Let me know where you're watching from, and I will reply back to you. And if you like the content that you're watching and you feel right at home, Go ahead and join the TF Game family by subscribing to the channel. Also, turn on your post notifications so you'll be notified every time I upload a video right here on this channel. And I need for everyone to smash that like button, hit that thumbs up button, and help the channel grow. It helps YouTube push the video out to other people on YouTube, and that helps the channel a whole lot. And I greatly appreciate it. Today we're gonna jump into a shoe. Y'all see the box? Should be a dead giveaway. This is a fire box. You see it says flight on the top of the box. Infrared 23 colorway George Jump, man. Let's go ahead and get the box. Get a little close. You have that pink splatter going on on top of your box. And it's actually going on all around the box. Give y'all a sneak peek of that label. Let's read it. it. says Air Jordan 4 Retro, color topaz, infrared 23, size 14, personal pair, retail price $200. Let's go ahead. Let's top up. You see that infrared 23 color lead. I do not see any lot stamp on the inside. Up the top, you see that paper. Is Flatter paper, that's the tissue you have in here. And pull them out. Yes, the coat hangs for us. Yeah, uh, close to looking at this sneaker. It's a very interesting sneaker and plain at the same time. Gonna get the other sneaker out. Of course, when the sneaker first uh, had picks, came out, people calling me the poor man Travel Scott. And you see I have my tag right here. I did get these from eBay, the eBay authentication tag is on here right here. I'm not sure if it does anything, but these were authenticated by eBay. I had to reach out to eBay to get my size. As you guys know, size 14 is be hard to get. But when I do get them, I try to get it. Right, man. Use the name Last Trade, baby. Also comes with your card. Authentication card. And it has instructions that you can find out that your pair is authentic. Just follow it and it'll take you somewhere. So you can see that the pair of sneakers that you purchased from eBay is authentic. Let's go ahead and grab the sneakers. Put them up here. Yes, guys, the Topaz 4s. Let's go in. Yes, guys, the Air Jordan 4 Topaz. Let's go in. The entire upper of the shoe is in the Topaz colorway. You got a nice grain of suede going on right here and on your toe box. But there's a different type of material going on here. It's like a rough scaly type material is going on here and around your mud guard but i haven't seen a lot of people saying this about the sneaker there's a way you can rub this off and it hides another layer of suede underneath here so if you want to see that other layer of suede that's underneath here and here you can rub away the crack looking material if you don't like that material, that's what you have here. You got your, your wing hits right here. It's just black with your black waffle here and here. You got your topaz netting with your black background. That's on your upper. You have a white midsole with the black midsole going on here. White going around your air housing, clear bubble, white inside, that black hit right here leads to the outsole, black outsole, you hit your infrared 23 right here, 
infrared 23 color Jordan jump man as well. White hit here. You have your herringbone traction going on. On the heel, black rubber piece, topaz color Jordan jump man. Yes, every sneaker can I have Nike Air on the back. Say it with me. Every sneaker can I have Nike Air on the back. A lot of people wish that these sneakers had Nike Air on the back, but it would take away from the Nike Air being on the back of a sneaker, in my opinion, if you were to put it on every sneaker that we wanted it to be on. So you have more of that, that nice suede going on here. And you got your white and your black on your midsole. More to the medial side of the sneaker. More of the same. You got your black wing, black waffle here and here. You got that crack scaly material here. And you got your topaz netting with the black background. More of that crack material. White midsole going around your air housing, clear bubble, white inside, and that black on your outsole from the midsole judging from the toe box this is a pretty good swing i give it a seven and a half eight out of ten then you got your toe paste netting going halfway all the way to right here on your tongue you got your black background you have black flat laces going on with these and you have your patch stitched on toe paste patch Infrared 23 color jaw jump man flight in black as well. You got more of that crack material on your tongue Flip the tongue around infrared 23 color wig on the other side of your tongue And the tongue is designed like it used to be back when these came out in 8788 somewhere around there and you got your pet stitched on the other side now Air Jordan and that is written in or printed in your infrared 23 colorway. Pull out your shoe tree. Call bull shoe tree. Say size 13, 14. Dark jump man logo. You wanna look on the inside. You have an infrared 23 insert. You got a black jaw jump man. And you have your sizes sticker, size 14. We have a black sock liner going on here, and we're going to get a look at that sizing tag. Here is the sizing tag. Air Jordan, Jumpman here, size 14, production date, get close, July 29th to October the 1st of last year. So, about two and a half months of production with this sneaker. Tell me what y'all think about this sneaker. Did y'all cop it? I touched a few pairs, but just none in my size. So when the, uh, the price was right, I jumped on it and got on my size. And looking at these black laces right here, get a good look at them. Yeah, check out this lace swap, y'all, that I did. I found some infrared 23 laces, all slickest. You know, they have some real good laces. They're one of the people I buy laces from. So let me know what y'all think of this look. Let me know what y'all think of this sneaker. And before I get out of here, like I always tell y'all, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack. I'm signing out.